us. Well, just the spirit of Horizon, isn't it? Shall we send a thank you? For this week's weekly challenge, we have innovation or ambition. To achieve it this week, you have to own and drive either a Nissan 2000 Nissan Silvia Spec R or a 2008 Mitsubishi Lancer Evolution GSRX. You have to own and drive it. You have to achieve 100 miles per hour in it, take a photograph of it, and achieve six stars at any danger sign. So I use the danger sign at the main hub and hit that thing three times to get my six stars. Because to get three stars, you need to have about 1,400 feet. So couldn't quite get it with this car, but hey, three times is nothing. Takes less than a minute to do it completely. So there you go. Next up, we have the trial. For this week's trial, I chose the Lexus RCF 2015. Um, it, I mean, I didn't really put much into it. It's a tune that I had in my garage. Um, I didn't really work on it. It's an old tune, but it served its purpose. I came in third and fifth, respectively, enough for myself and the team to com successfully complete the trial for this week. So. I wasn't carried and I wasn't doing any carrying this week. This is a good middle of the ground car to choose, should you choose to. Just get it to A and it should be good, whatever tuning you choose to put on it. So uh, I'll not share the share code for this. Unless you request it, then I'll put it in the description below. But on to the next one. Next up is the Event Labs race. Last week we did not have one, this week we do, and it's decent. It's not terribly hard. Um, I happen to have the driver tar difficulty pretty high on this one. So for five laps, if you keep your difficulty high for this, you could max out and get a good amount of experience points and money for this race. So for this race, I chose the 1986 Ford Escort RS Turbo. Uh, no particular tune. It's a C-Class race, so get on out there, put what you got to put on the car, and go for it. I had some points coming into this week from doing the Rivals races, as you should too, so that should successfully have completed the points that you needed. If not, go take a photograph and do the treasure chest and that would be on the next episode but uh if you did and you followed the tips and the guides for every week before then you should have this mustang right now and i'll tell you right now i love it it's great it sounds great it drives great over 1400 herspers i'd say go follow this guide and go get yourself one because it's well worth the time and the effort and they made it pretty easy to get this week, so there's no excuses. Go get yourself a Mustang SVT. Thanks for tapping in. Peace. <laughs> 